Welcome back everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Astronauts. We've just met a very, very not nice man who immediately attacked us, so... <laughs> unfortunately, we had to run because we really don't have a proper weapon and I've never done combat in this game. There wasn't any combat. Target Kayla extension. Oh, there we go. It's actually telling us to go back now uh, and get detailed info. Okay. Uh, I wanted to return to Kayla anyway. Um... Yeah, that one. Kinetic phase. Ugh. I wish we could get through there, but no. Ugh, no, no, no. I didn't want to do that. Okay. So, K-Leg. That's where we're going. Let's turn around. A little too much. There we go. Let's decrease our velocity. There we go. All right. Oop, I was already practically there. Now, let's accelerate. Apparently, I cannot finish a single sentence today, so I do apologize. <clears throat> We're 160 kilometers away, which should be good if we... What? Objective completed, aim to spin stopped, rear thrust calibrated. Holy moly. Clockwise thrust calibrated. Oh, it's just... It's teaching us about all the things. Oh, okay. Calibrate forward thrust. Press the W or the key to reduce below 10 meters a second again. Okay, that's that's fine. Uh, we don't care about that for now. This is just tutorials, but it's nice that it's actually uh, teaching you that stuff now. Okay, so I also, while the game was loading this, I noticed a tip that said... Oh, I'm getting pretty close to that. Um... I saw a tip that said if you want to, uh, you can designate zones within your ship. Now, for this one, that's no point because it's too small. But you can, you know, you can stop uh, NPCs from going into the uh, forbidden areas. We're going to go right through that. I don't like that one bit. I'm going to have some lateral thrust and get out of there a little bit more. Because we are going quite fast. <clears throat> and uh, crashing at this speed would not be a good idea. Also, we have to remember that this k is on a planet. Which means that we cannot just fly through it. I mean, uh, if it was on that side, we cannot just fly in a straight line. We'd have to fly around the planet. I think it's an asteroid, actually, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. I'm going to clear that, because we're going past it. We could have dogged there as well, I suppose, but, um... Wait, bearing... Eh, fine. Um, we could have dogged there, but we don't really... Yeah, why is it... Why is it... Showing us... What? That's not right. There we go. Something like this. Better. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, uh, yeah, we could have dogged there, but we are pretty much full on everything. So we're going to take it easy for now. Go back. The problem is, because we're so low on money at the moment, anytime we dock at a port, it's going to cost us a fair bit of money. Um, because we have to pay docking fees, electrical fees, oxygen fees, yada, yada, yada. I'm going to be a bit more careful here because we cannot just strafe away if we overshoot this. Because there is kind of an asteroid in the way. So uh, we're going to take it easy. Uh, we're six kilometers out. Uh, we'll need to get some uh, RCS. Um, we'll buy that. Okay, docking we're we're most likely, um, oh, no docking facilities. Okay, like docking accepts. We're pretty close already. And a bit misaligned, but that's okay. Um, yeah, we have to get RCS. Uh, we'll probably have uh, recharged our batteries. Um, I believe that's done automatically. That's why you get um, 
that's why you have to pay an electrical fee as well. Um, you know, so that's that's all good. There we go. Let's dock. Squawk two two nine or two. Dock twelve. And now it loads the area, so you know the game stops a little bit. Now we're at Kaleg. We can uh, start selling these things. Now I believe the only way to sell uh, will be to actually bring the stuff here. Well, maybe not, because you'd have to drag it, right? Sell other wanted items, loading items. Okay. Uh, loading items. Send items to barter zone. So nothing. They don't want anything here. Shoe, black wing, Terra, da -da -da. shirt, canisters. See, they got RCS, uh, scrubber, cartridge. Oh, a lithium oxygen hydrate cartridge designed for use in shipboard atmosphere scrubbers for life support. In an exothermic reaction, uh, it bonds with CO2 from the air to produce lithium carbonate and H2O. Uh, so, wawa in heat. Ships require about one cartridge per day for each crew member. Oh, wow, okay. I didn't even think about that. So these are... Yeah. Do we have any scrubbers? I mean, surely we do, right? CO2 filter, EVA. They've added a lot of stuff. Hacksaw. Screwdriver. Like new. Um, super handy equipment truck. Oh! Essential to any efficient salvage operation. This dolly can hold large, cumbersome items and transport them with ease. Oh, that's nice. It is pretty darn expensive, though. Uh, we have to first see if we can sell some of this stuff. So, this kiosk is not the only place where we can sell things. Uh, that's the kick licenses only. Oh, we buy scrap. That's where we can uh, get it. Let's see licenses. Oh, yeah. Derelict salvage ordinance and license. The Iotimiwa Ship Breaking Company Board has taken action in accordance with, with Corporate Code 234 to regulate vessel salvage and resale. The action will require screening standards and a daily license issued through the licenses only kiosk. License holders are granted access and salvage rights to Iotimiwa derelict property in the designated off-world areas during the listed period. Listed below are frequently asked questions. How much is a license? 5,000 or 24 hours. Can I be... Oh. Can I be cited for not having the uh, salvage license? Yes. If your business is found to meet the ordinance definition of a salvage provider, you may be cited for every day that you remain in business without a license or without proper equipment. Can the company close my business if uh, I do not obtain a salvage license? Yes. <laughs> of course they do. How, does, uh, how do they determine if business is a salvage provider or a reseller? Local authorities and NAS designated vessels will patrol OKLEC airspace. Airspace? Interesting. Uh, they will conduct an inspection of the vessels being salvaged. If salvage operations are observed, then the business is considered a salvage provider that must have a license and equipment that complies with the ordinance. If the business does not have a license or compliant equipment, then fines can be issued. Okay. So something to keep in mind. We have to stay away from the police. So let's try to trade here. Spare screen like new cell. There we go. Loyalty. But it's only what we're carrying. Oh, that sucks. How do we... I'll have to check that out. Shoe. Uh, look at how little all these things go for. Okay, so let's try that N thing um, and designate areas on our ship. We also don't want to stay here for too long. Select zones. Add new zone. Oh, select tiles. Okay, like that. Oh, okay, just select everything then. There. Add new zone. All barter. Okay. Okay. Well, for now, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna allow all and see if that helps. Do we have any... Ugh, ugh. I clicked away. Do we have any goals? No, not at the moment. So let's go back to the thing and see if we can sell stuff now i think it would be better just to um no oh zone one there we go perfect motor like new scrap used trashed wow we're getting very little money for these things 
Wow. These things used to go for a lot more money, I remember. But there's also... Um, there's also NPCs on the station which might trade with us and give us a lot more. This is a tram, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, loading. What else do we have here? Sleeping areas. That's where we started. Is that still our bed? I think it's still our bed, right? Uh, no. I guess it doesn't belong to us. And the, um... The thing never told us... Wait a second. This is an airlock. Where is the tram? I know there's a tram somewhere. Or supposed to be. Battery charger. Oh! I have that off. Oh, that's okay. Loading can go through there. Airlock? So where is the tram? There's another... No, it's not an airlock. Let's go over here. What's all this stuff on the floor? Oh. Why is it so... Wait, wait, wait. There was a... There was an air leak there, wasn't there? Oh no. I thought that was, but no, it was just interesting. Well, don't mind if I do. Bing. Let's uninstall this. Flammable sheet. Uh door opens. Okay. Let's take the bed. Wait for sleeping and napping. Let's uninstall this one as well. I guess there's no one here. I don't think anyone will uh, mind us taking this. I don't know. I could be wrong. Like I said, I haven't played this in a long time, so... Ugh. Why is this one all... Ugh. There we go. We've got a bunch of other, bunch of other stuff here. Cigarette stub? Ugh. Cigarette box... Cigarette box. A 20 count menthol flavored Viceroy brand cigarette box for a cleaner burn. The eponymous Red Rabbit adorns the front in the classic salute pose spacers used to signal break time. Sweeter than oxygen, yeah, I'm sure. Okay, we're gonna sell these things. Let's also turn that off. So, I'm slightly confused. I think they changed the this area inventory let's see what did we take stuff out of from the fridge no we didn't vent sink rack nothing there okay i like the sound of um of oxygen that's pretty cool so we could try going through these doors, but I think that would be considered a crime. But yes, I'm kind of confused now. Where is the tram? I thought this place had a tram. Because right now, if we try to lift, I mean, if we try to go, uh, where is the back pump six stuff floor? Wait, where is the console? Where we pay our docking fees. Fuel floor. No. Let's try to use this. There we go. Service units. Uh, so, grand total is 900. And we're not even refueling. See, that's what I'm talking about. Fines, fees, and subtotal. So, dockage is 300. Uh, it's per hour. We've got power that we've taken, uh, life support, air exchange, so very expensive. So even before buying, uh, I believe this is nitrogen. Wait, I can't even buy it. Huh. Okay. 
Oh, sorry, not not nitrogen. Um, RCS fuel. Here, look at that. I mean, it's not that expensive, but we still don't have enough money for this. So that's why I'm trying to find where that uh, where that uh, tram is. Well, let's just talk to someone. Uh, ask what's up. Stop right there. He's a bartender. He's unremarkably social. Isn't saying much to anyone. Uh, gently places their hand on Evan McCormick's arm. What? No thanks. See, everything affects us. Uh, autonomy would go up, but the respect and intimacy and self-worth would go down. Um, back off, back away slowly. Uh, flirt. Are they trying to flirt with us already? Intimidate. Oh, geez, there's a lot more. I hope they make this into a bigger menu. Can it be made into a bit? I don't know. Basic. Ask how they are. Uh, they change the subject. Okay. Basic. Melly. I don't want Melly. Offer smoke. Okay, offer smoke. Uh, feels they are being helpful. Uh, they're not interested in smoking. They're cool and distant. And we also learn stuff about them, which is pretty cool. They also have a piracy brand. Show trick. We do a stupid trick. They're cool and distant. Let's out a surprise burst of laughter. Temperature gas. Oh, that's what they have. Okay. There's so much stuff. Okay, we're just going to leave for now. Later. Uh, yeah. Wait, there's a transit. Access transit, not bash it. There we go. So that was a tram. So we're here uh, at Port Azikiwe. Old Emporium. Commercial. Let's go to commercial. Boarding tram. Yeah, every hour costs us. Stepping off the tram. Let me pause this. Stepping off the tram at Kaleg's commercial district. The difference is immediately apparent. It's not nicer, but maybe less worn out? Like less people come here. Or at least less rough and tumble types. The main port of interest here is the Port Authority office, a place every captain inevitably becomes familiar with as they navigate the web of red tape surrounding spaceport operations. Usually you'll find at least a few pilots and ship owners slouched in line here, down on their luck and hoping for a break. The longer the line, the more likely that the nice clerk is on duty today. Doo -doo. Okay, so... What I did before, this guy usually bought a lot of stuff. But I guess not? What's up? Okay, he's ignoring us. Ask about top of the uh, ask about skills. Designing, building, and maintaining spacecraft. Offer smoke. No, it's not this guy. It was a different guy. Okay. Other jobs. Oh my god, why does it keep changing? Stop! Stop it! I think it would be best if it was paused. Look at us. Hey, look at us. Look at us. Okay. Um, so this is not helpful to me. And he walked away anyway! See the self-care thing. Van Buren gnaws away anti-nausea pills, uh, pain relief, pain relief, antibiotic, splint. Interesting. Okay. Terminal floor. No, 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 don't bash it. No. No, don't, don't, damn it. Cancel. Cancel. 
don't want to get into trouble with the police now. Not immediately, anyway. Uh, so is this the port authority? It looks like it. Get out of there. It's my turn. Access port, port authority. Address, not access. Hello to the desk clerk. Glances at Evan McCormick and says, how can I help you? Um, intimidate. Okay. Look busy. Complain about authorities. Talk about weather. Lightly touch. Metaphysical quandaries. So, scan room. Okay. Uh, subject jobs. Replied. Okay. Ask for a break. Evan McCormick asks if they can have a break just this one time. Gambits are special moves that can persuade a target to yield a positive outcome in high-stakes conversation, but they often require the target to be in a specific mood or relationship to work. Valiant, where one target has micromanaged, depressed, pestered, badgered. Um, so, before we do that, let's soften them up a bit. A bit. Tend you're important. Oh, they're talking to fabricate an urgent mission? The use of their ship? Try to make them laugh. Makes an amusing observation about the surroundings. Sonia Maxwell takes a deep breath and nods. Oh, good. That went well. Metaphysical quandary. Nobody here is qualified to answer. And they don't talk about weather. Oh, dark joke for Evan McCormick. Okay. Nod one up. Not to be outdone, Evan McCormick fires back using even more esoteric technical jargon. Burst out laughing. There we go. Let's have some laughter. You know, soften them up, make them our friends so we can always go free here. Well, we wouldn't. Later. No! No later. What's up? Shrugs and says not much. Ask about skills. Designing, building, and maintaining spacecraft. Address. Oh, they are. Huh? What happened? Tenure important. I don't want an, a gambit. I want them. I want them to wait. Wait for them to reply. Okay. What's up? I'm a little confused still about this. Uh... Oh, they tell me to back off. They need some space. Okay, sorry. Sorry. Okay, never mind. Bye. Replied. Oh, they're now an acquaintance. Uh, s smile demurely. Um, lightly touched. Gently places her hand. So... Oh, they're gently places, placing their hand in my arm now? Okay. Nod. Do they have any interesting skills? Uh, I do. Skilled in zero-g ops. Okay. Reassure with logic. I have logic. I am reassuring you. <laughs> they take a deep breath and nod. They're cherished. La 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 la. Scan the room. Security. I am scanning the room. Come with me if you want to leave. He tells a dark joke. Melee attack. Uh, okay, let's laugh. Ha! It's so funny. You tell joke. It's funny. Unremarkably social feels liked by others. So, um, okay, leave later. We don't have time for this. All right. So, are we still in a conversation? No, I said I said later. Later. Let's see the gate kiosk. Maybe we can make some money here after all. Ah, uh, yeah, courier. Own patch to Caleb Gray. That's not much money. Zero money. Oh, cost is zero. Oh, that's the payout. Okay. Um, 
is seeking secure and prompt delivery of a used scavenger license to Brooke Jimenez, who needs the item in question to use as leverage in a future negotiation. Old Emporium. Oh. Just bring it to someone. It's not much money, but it is something. Okay, we can take this one. And I'll take it wrong pickup kiosk. What? But it's here. Hiya, poopy. What the hell? Um, you are to locate Colby Hood on the future pre uh, prefect and take a photograph. Okay, like for the Is seeking secure and prompt delivery of prototype RCS intake. Who needs the item in question because it belonged in a long time ago? Cost payout. Yeah, insufficient funds because you need to actually pay him um, a fee just in case you, you know, steal it. Skilled operator, romantic entrapment, um, secure and prompt delivery of bottle. Oh, pickup locker, okay, lag, clients. It's currently even the flotilla. Jeez. Moaning touchstone. Secure and prompt delivery of prototype formula. Okay, all of these are far away, so, I mean. You know, reasonably far away. Um, I'm still getting my bearings. Is this really all there is to this place? I remember it being a lot bigger. I kind of go there. And there's no trader there, unfortunately. That was very useful. Um, like a year or so ago when I last played. Yeah. I don't see any traders, so I'm guessing we'll have to use the kiosk. That sucks. Okay, let's try our luck. Address. And let's do the gambit. Where's the gambit? Come on. Hello? Uh, gambit. Ask for a break. Uh says if they gave every comedian around here a break, they would lose their job. Sonia Maxwell asks Evan McCormick to pay their fee if they want to leave the station. Damn it. Okay, fine. Uh, threaten to call the manager. No, pretend you're important. Do you know who you're talking to? Do you know? No. Oh, it says no. They have no idea who you are. <laughs> okay, never mind. Let's go. I'm not doing anything here. Hey, do you want to buy my stuff? Remember cheating death right home. No, we're, we're talking to ourselves here. Let's talk to this guy. What's up? Oh, bye. Okay, well, yes, I know you're still talking to me. I'm. I don't care. Door opens. Replied. No thanks. Oh, this is, this is not that easy to use here. Okay, let's access transit and go to the old emporium. See if we can find a traitor there because yeah oh wow the red neons cast heavy shadows in the old emporium Kaleg's only leisure district the oe is a relic of a former world a portal to the halcyon days of the wildcat nigerian colony before earth's ablation cascade gutted the economy spacers come here to escape the bureaucratic grind to imagine a world without bosses to split a chilled bottle of bismertnyaya even when they can't afford to a dozen meters away from the shuttle stop, you see a knot of revelers gathered in the warm light of the Mascaform bar. Laughter and conversation float through Mascaform in a melange of English, Mandarin, and even Yoruba. That last one might be a sign IO managers are mixing it up with the common folk. Whatever the language, the warm organics of human voices in close proximity is a welcome departure from the hollow echo of calm chatter. No. One of the faces in the crowd is the fixer. There we go. 
They're a known quantity in the station community, Kalex portal to a system-wide, ever-shifting black market whose appetite for used ship parts and other rare salvage can never be sated. Shouldn't be too hard to get the fixer talking. Just mention you have something to trade and they're likely to be interested. There we go, that's who we need. Anyway, we're gonna do this next time. So thank you very much for watching. I know this has been a bit slow, but, you know, that's part of the game as well. Um, so thank you for watching. A big thank you to my Patreons for all of your support. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.